Bonjour tout le monde. Hello everyone. We have a new Dumoki class. Uh, welcome to your class. And in today's video, we are going to continue with the numbers. As we have done from 0 to 10 in the last video. In this video, you are going to see how to write from 11 to 20. And after that, we are going to discuss a few accents in French. Right? Accents are some signs which change the pronunciation of the letter or the word. Fine? So, shall we start the class? Let's go. Today, we are going to do les nombres, the numbers. Right? Les nombres, the numbers. And 11, we call Ons. O and Z E Ons, which you can write in Hindi like this. Then we have twelve. We call it Doos. G O U Z E Doos. Then we have thirteen. T R E I Z E Taz Fine Then we go fourteen Kathars Kathars Where we see Q U A T O R Z E Kathars Remember it is T O R because generally students make this mistake, they write T-R-O. No, it's T-O-R. Why? Are you getting? Then take 15. 15 we write TANS. Q-U-I-N-Z-E. TANS. Fine. Then we have SAS. 16. S E I Z E says, why? Right? So you need to write like this in Hindi. Let's move further. 17. These set. As you have already done 10 and 7, here there is a combination of 10 and 7. 17. Right? In French, we write 17 like this. These set. D-I-X. These. S-E-P-T. Set. These set. 17. Then, 18. These with. These with. D-I-X. H-U-I-T. These with. Then, 19 would be these enough. 9 you have already done. So, D-I-X and E-U-F, these enough. Then, 20 would be 1. 20 would be 1. V-I-N-G-T. V-I-N-G-T. 1. So, this was 11 to 20. Now, we are going to discuss few accents. In French, we are having 5 accents. Axon aigu, axon grave, axon circumflex, trema is city. Right? So, look at the board. So, les accents. As I told you in the beginning, that accents are some signs which change. The pronunciation of the letter and the word. So the first text in this accent aigu. Right? Accent aigu. And we find this accent only on E. And it is like this. I generally call it a takeoff accent. Just to remember, 
you can see it's taking off like this. So I'm giving you a few words uh, for this like you can say there are some words in your book as well. Take out page number. Eighteen. On page number eighteen, you have some accents, right? So first accent is accent aigu, and here are some words given for example, right? So whenever you are going to do these accents, turn page number eighteen these week, fine? So first example would be. A call, elephant, elephant is elephant, a call is school. Now, you have one more accent, action grab, right? And this accent comes on E, A, and U. Now, this slanting line will go downward. Fine? So, I generally call it landing accent as well. Fine? To remember the word or the accent, you can call it landing accent and take off accent. What? So, take one example. Ragle. There you can see the accent on E. Ragle. Ragle is scale. Then we have O. O means where. O means where. Then we have third accent that is accent circumflex. Right? You can give it a name chapeau and it comes like this. like a cap so we call it a cap or chapeau we call cap in uh, French we call it chapeau so that's why I call it action chapeau right for example you can say hotel hotel is hotel here you'll find this accent on O right and uh, you can go for that. That is head. That is head. Here you you can see this accent on e. Fine. Then you can say eel. Eel is island. Whenever you are putting this accent on e. Or uh, sorry, uh, on I, you are not going to put that dot. Instead of, you need to put the accent. Fine. I, E, L, E is E, which means an island. I hope you are getting. So that's all for today and we are going to meet in the next video. Till then, revise well, stay home, stay safe. Bye.